welcome back, Best Uni Crew. It's your girl. Come back on real quick, like try something else. Um, I told y'all I wanted to try to do one of the bath sets from Dollar Tree. I could not find the toothbrush holder. Um, all I seen was like the little lotion holder thing. And it is like a ceramic. So I'm thinking maybe we can sublimate on it, right? But we had to put something over it, like a laminating paper or something like that. Um, kind of want to try without the laminating paper, but I don't want to waste nothing. But I will do one side probably. Um, so far, I got the image of my choice, which is this one here. I printed it out on uh, a sub paper. I got me some thermal heat, uh, laminated sheets. Got my little mini press Mama Gloria bought me. And um, the sizing I did for this one was 2.5 width and 3.5 height. So, I'm just going to wing it pretty much. I don't know. It should work with this, uh, the laminating paper. But I want to be able to put it in the oven. But I'm going to do it with this mini press first because I want to see can it hold heat without cracking or breaking. And um, and if it hold up pretty good with some heat, then I might try, um, try it again another way. Cutting me a little piece of that laminated paper, and I'm going to try to get my little greasy hands off of it. And I'm gonna press some of that laminated paper down on it. And I'm just really eyeballing, trying to cut. I ain't got no perfect measurements because, like I said, I'm just trying. So. Get my heat tape. Try to hold it down on there. Maybe I should try to cut it even, but... Try to tape it down. We just kind of hold the laminated paper right there for me. Maybe I can see because I notice I've been moving out of camera a lot. Tape go. Anisha lost that game again, but she's still a winner to me. Okay, give me a little piece of paper, and I'm just gonna just try to. Press the lemonade paper down on here. Now, I thought about putting this in the uh, heat press, but then I know it wasn't going to get certain areas. So, I'm just going to play with it right here. I'm just going to um, try to do the heat. Oh. 
Okay, y'all. Yeah, next time, I might put it in the oven. But I don't know. So far, it seems like it holds heat pretty good. But this little mini press is like super little. So I'm going to probably put a little more heat to it with the heat gun. I thought I um, kind of do the picture a couple times. So, I would say try it in the oven. I really would. Because this here, this ain't for me. All this down. Maybe I should have some willpower and keep holding. It's almost on there. And I am going to put that motherfucker in the oven. Because I feel like it will work. It's just this little bit of mini press is not getting the heat that it needs. Then I ain't giving it enough pressure and enough time and all that kind of stuff. I just so I feel like the curve is what's gonna throw. Me. It's what's gonna throw me. I'm gonna buy another one tomorrow, and I'm gonna wrap the whole thing with laminating paper, right? I'm going to put it in the oven. Because, I mean, like, it's it's hot, but it's holding the heat pretty good. So, look at that. Y'all, what y'all think about that? Probably should have kept going, huh? I should have just did the oven technique forever. I was scared. But now we know not to be scared. I just kind of want to try to put it in the oven. But should I try? I'm going to try. I'm going to try, y'all. Okay, guys. So, I already put the laminated paper on here. And I did it with my mini press. It looks kind of bumpy, but it is what it is. And I am going to wrap this painter's tape around it. And hopefully, it do what it's supposed to do without making a mess. Man, I ain't gonna lie to you, girl. A little scared. But all I keep hearing y'all say is, "Girl, you got this." So I'm gonna try. And if it works, ho ho ho! Game changer. Get a little zen. We're figuring it out. Now, wow, we're gonna be making our own stove stuff. Shoot. Whew. Okay, y'all. Let's let's just pray. We're gonna wrap this around like this. Wrap this. like this. I'm gonna try to pull it tight as possible. I just need it to like put a little pressure on the paper. Pray, y'all. We just don't pray. That's all we can do. I blow some shit up, y'all. Better come get me and let me stay with y'all. I can 
just did it like this for all I know. Ooh, it already smells good. Mama, the truth. I got scared <laughs> and I kept unplugging the thing and turning it off. But we just gonna see. Scaring me, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be no bitch. I was a bitch. I was scared. It smells weird. I don't know if that top already looked like that or not. Oh yeah, I overcooked that motherfucker. I'm not trying to turn it off and look like. Oh, this is the other side. So I can't tell which side is what. camera is dying okay what I did was because when I took it out I guess because my scary ass didn't leave it in there long enough I um left the paper on there and then I started using the heat gun my battery about to die y'all but it will work next time I'm, I'm gonna buy another one I'm gonna stop being scared I'm gonna leave it in the oven because that heat gun did this or whatever when I took it off it off from the oven it looked like that because I didn't leave it in there long enough so I would say leave it in there for about eight, six, seven minutes or so. Put a timer on, but you see, I was scared. So, but the heat gun made this much happen. So yeah, make sure y'all come in, like, and subscribe. Give y'all girl her likes. I be trying to shit over here. I be damn near burning my house up. So y'all have a blessed one. Thank you.